Welcome back to another video on the Discord.py voice rewrite um, latest version. Uh, in the last video on this, we went over pretty basic commands uh, like the join, leave, and play commands. Uh, we're focusing on the voice side of uh, the bot. Um, we also, in the last video, went over how to install FFmpeg and uh, use the pip to install uh, discord.py voice along with youtube-dl in this video we will be using the code we first made in the first video uh, but we'll be building off of that with three more basic commands uh, such as uh, pause, resume, and stop uh, three commands that will help people using your bot um, kind of uh, commanded to do certain things that they would want and help them so here are the imports for this video uh, and last video um, but in this video we will not be using these two imports uh, those two are pretty much for the play command right now uh, as we add more videos this series will probably expand on more ideas using these um, but we will use these imports. So basically, discord, discord dot extensions, com uh, getting the commands, and then uh, getting a utility git. Right. So one last thing before we start. Um, if you've if you've watched the last video and you're using these three commands, uh, you can you'll notice that in the console it prints out. Uh, what it's downloading and the YouTube DL stuff all that cr junk so if you're kind of annoyed by that and you don't want it uh, you can add it quiet here and do this and just add true put a comma at the end and it is quieted so let me showcase this for you so I run the bot here it's gonna pop up let's know that it joined Give it a second here. The first time you ever run the code, it always takes a long time to do its thing here. Alright, there it goes. Alright, so we're going to jump over to my other monitor here. And then we're going to... to so I'm in the general. We're going to join. It is joined. And then we're going to do play. We do that. Let me check the... Bring him down a little bit. Alright, so he's in there. We're going to do the play command. Alright, we're going to come jump back over here. You can see now it says downloading audio now. It's not going to print anything out. None of the YouTube DL stuff. And it's just going to start playing. There we go. And now, as you can see on my other monitor over here, you see playing this. Alright, we're just going to leave to stop him there. Alrighty. So now, back over here. So that was just one thing I forgot to add into the last video, kind of something that might some people might appreciate. Um, so we're going to stop this. Close you. Alrighty. So let's get on to the pause command. So we're going to copy this, as this is pretty much the same for all commands. So we're going to do that. We're gonna going to PA. And then get you, alright? You want to be careful when you do aliases that you don't do two commands that have the same aliases because it'll bug the, uh, the uh, bot out. You want to do pause. So we also do not want this URL here. Make sure to get rid of the uh, comma. Alrighty, so for pause, we are going to do... These are uh, three basic commands, so they don't take much. Voice get uh, voice or no, not voice. We want bot dot voice clients. There we go. And then we want guild equals ctx dot guild. All right. So all three commands will have that. So we'll pretty. We'll pretty much just copy that over and then we'll do a basic if statement so voice and 
voice that is underscore playing. So, so this what this does is it's a check. So it checks if it's if the bot's in a voice channel, and then if it is, if it's playing music, right? So if that's true, we'll print something out in the console. We'll print um, music pause, right? And then we will do voice dot pause. Alrighty. And then we will do an await. We'll send something into the Discord here. We'll send a message dot send. We'll do music paused. Alrighty. And then we'll do an else statement. We'll do print music not playing. Alrighty. And then we'll send the same message into the Discord. Music not playing. We'll add a failed pause at the end here. So it doesn't confuse people. Alrighty. So what this does is it gets the voice and stuff like that, and then it checks to see if we're in a voice. I've already gone over this, but I'm going to go over it again. Uh, it checks to, to make sure that it's in a voice channel, then it makes sure that it is playing music, and then if it is, it prints that out on the console, pauses the music, and then sends this to the Discord. And if it's not, it prints this out on the console, music not playing, failed pause, and then it sends this into the Discord. So that is all your pause command is so we'll basically just copy the top part of this and paste it there change these to resume because we need to be able to resume the paused music r for resume and then res for resume all right so you want to get this as well, so we're just going to copy this from up here. Paste it into there. Alrighty. And then do an if voice and voice dot is underscore paused. So this does the same thing, checks if it's in a voice uh, channel. And then checks to see if uh, music that was playing is paused. Then if it is, we'll just print something out here. We'll print music print out resumed music. I had to think of something there. All right, resumed music. All right, and then we'll do voice. Voice dot resume. Then we'll do an await. We'll send something into Discord here. CTX dot send. Zoomed music. All right. Then we'll do else statement. Print out into the console. Music is not paused. And we'll send something into the Discord. Alright. Music is not paused. Alrighty. So the stop command is fairly similar to the pause command. So just copy this, paste it there. Name it to stop. Come up and put S there. STO. And then for the stop command, we're going to copy this part of the resume command. Alrighty. And then just copy all of this down here. And then we'll just change this part to stop 
Then change this part to stopped. Music stopped. Music. We'll put no music playing failed to stop. Alright, then we will copy all that. Paste it there. And that is truly it for pause, resume, and stop commands. Alrighty, so let's test them out here. Alright, so we're going to run our bot. Make sure it joins here. And there we go. Alrighty. Come back over to this monitor. Alright, we're in the general. We're going to have them join. Slash join. There he is. Alright, then we're going to play this video. Audio. Alrighty. And then you can see over here we've removed the old song file and then we've downloaded it and now we've renamed it and we're playing it and you can hear it. So we'll go back over here. Alright. Well, I don't want to listen to it, but I don't want to get rid of it, so we'll pause it. Alright, music is paused. Come over here. Mo music paused. Come back over here. Then we want to resume it. Zoom. Resumed. Pause again. Oh. Alrighty. And then the stop command stops it. And then you can just literally play another song. Once it downloads. There you go. That is it. That is all there is to the three, to these three commands. Pause, resume, and stop. All right, we're going to stop it. All right, come back over here. All right, so as you can see here, we'll make this a little bigger. Ignore this part. Uh, that's when I accidentally typed in resume. Um, so as you can see, it's, play, it's playing it. Then we paused it, music paused, and then we resumed it, and then we paused it again, then we resumed it again, and then we stopped it. Alrighty. And then it printed out, it has finished playing, so it saw the, the code saw that it was finished playing, and it printed this out. And then uh, we went to play it again, so it removed the old one, downloaded a new one, and then renamed it played it and then we stopped it and then it printed it out so those are the three basic commands pause resume and stop pretty simple um, so thank you for watching um, the links link uh, links will be in the description for a uh, link to the discord that I've uh, been on a few people have joined ask for some help um, you can join ask for some help talk to others Get some ideas for your bots, whatever you'd like, honestly. Um, also, the download for all of the, this whole file, I will be putting in the description for you guys to download. Maybe you want to use it or just take a look at it, take a closer look. Um, there will also be a download for FFmpeg. If you want to know how to install that, go back to the first video. I've gone, I went over that. Um, also, the pip commands to install everything for the bot will be in the description and uh, I will also have a decently large discord.py bot that I've been working on if you want to take a look at that it's over 2,000 lines I think um, get some ideas for that use my bot whatever you want to do um, just go take a look at that if you'd like so uh, thank you for watching hopefully you've learned something if you need any help or anything honestly just join the discord ask me or ask anyone else in there if they can help you um, but thank you. I'll see you in the next one.